Drizzle's crown is beyond this door. Okay, let's go, go, go. I'm going first this time. Oh, Bluey. Crikey, what the XU's problem? <laughs> well, this don't look too clever. Old Brickface over there ain't gonna let us through, is he? We're not gonna get in with him on the door. Mm. If the Guardian will not allow us to pass, then we must pass through the Guardian.
maybe. We barely put a dent in it. Oh, I don't know about that. Let's keep working it and see what happens, shall we? We have beaten him into submission. Now is our chance. Lizard Slash! You know what? I think we might be able to send him flying. Literally. Colosseum. It sure is. I've been looking forward to this. A moment. Ah, but of course. The self-satisfied swordsman. <laughs> so, despite your protestations to the contrary, you were with the Lightlings all along. No, nope, but I signed up with them. Figured they'd lead me straight to you. And they sure didn't disappoint. Time to pick up where we left off. Let's go! Please do desist. Prior to combat, let us make inquiries of him and determine his identity. Seconded. And I would know what business he has with us lightnings. <laughs> do not fret, little ones. I mean to tell you everything. To begin. It seems only right that I introduce myself. I am Velasco. Last and greatest king of the children of the night. The children of the night? Isla spoke of a force. I take it your people stand against the children of the light. So... You have learned something of the world's true nature since last we met. If so, you must have also learned of the centuries of oppression my people have suffered at the hands of your forebears. <sighs> hmm. A long, long time ago, under the guidance of the goddess, your noble ancestors conspired to attack the father of the children of night, the great black dragon. By their treachery, my master was robbed of his strength and sealed away against his will using the power of Yggdrasil, the world tree. After this, the world was flooded with light, and only light. And monsters began to forget their eons old enmity with man. Becoming little better than sniveling lapdogs. 
What? Are you saying that, that monsters are meant to attack humans? I refuse to believe it. It's not in their nature. How wrong you are. <gasps> it was not just the monsters your kind corrupted, my dear. The very fabric of the world itself was warped. Warped by the unjust actions of the children of light. I crave but one thing. That the natural balance be restored. That the darkness be allowed to retake its rightful place Stop in the him. world. He's going to hurl that thing at Yggdrasil. Not if I can help it. No, wait! <laughs> My dear Lightlings, you make it too easy. What? In heaven! Come on! Break! Free! <laughs> This altar is a thing most sacred. Only the children of night and light may approach it. What better place than this to set my trap? <laughs> Lightlings, witness the power of the circle of night. <laughs> plunge the children of light into darkness also. <laughs> now, down you go. To the blackest depths of night. No, I won't let you do that. Hmm? It's time for the slime to shine. What in? <laughs> An amusing interlude. But just a little too far fetched. As if a heel slide would bear the circle of light. <laughs> <laughs> What joy, what pleasure, what sweet satisfaction! Now, Lightlings, let your minds and your bodies drink in the darkness and relinquish your hold over the world tree. It will not take long for the blackness to seep down and gain a stranglehold on the Drassel's roots. And when it does, that detestable seal will be broken and my master my god, the great black dragon shall rise again! <laughs> Listen, you must promise me, promise me, uh, uh, that you will never let him win! <laughs> I think it's time for us to go. From, from this place? But surely you do not intend to, to, to jump? It's all right. There'll be no need for anything so dramatic as that. Oh. Unfairly from them. If 
only I hadn't just run in like that without thinking, then he wouldn't have... This is no time to be blaming yourself. If anyone is at fault here, it is I. Hmm? Your Majesty? In this world of ours, there live certain stout-hearted souls. Warriors, charged with the sacred task of protecting the children of the light. Guardians. And I, your humble king, count myself among their number. Being such, it has ever been my sworn duty to protect the two of you, come what may. But you're the king, and we're just soldiers. You're saying you were supposed to protect us? Just so. All the rulers of my line have held this self-same honor. And yet, alas, I was unequal to the task. I failed in my duty. And one of my charges came to harm. No! Ma! I shall dwell no more on such woes! Not while a glimmer of hope yet remains! What? Are you saying there might be a way to bring him back to us? I know not, but there can be no harm in seeking counsel. The goddess may yet provide. When you say the goddess, would I be right in thinking you mean the same goddess who sealed away the dark dragon? Do me a lemon, what chance you got of speaking to a bleeding goddess? There is a place in this wondrous world of ours where the children of light may go to hear her speak. A sacred tower known as the Pinnacle of Light. I have never visited the Hallow Spire myself, but legends tell that at its very top stands an altar wherein the goddess dwells. So if we go there, we might be able to save Yggdrasil and help bring him back as well. You must journey thither. And I, for one, shall journey with you. And I, noble friend, I will adhere to you until our journey's very end, as shall we all. Well, is this not so, friends? Hmm? Hey. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Truly we are blessed! Never were there more dependable companions! And it's settled. To the pinnacle of light! Welcome, child. Let us pray. Goddess Speed. ourselves.
trying to break into that room. He must want to destroy the Oracle before we can reach it. We can't let him have his way.
Just fire in flames all over the place. The infernal contraption must be intended to keep intruders at bay. Stay alert, friends. Is it just me, or does that thing look tougher than the average monster? It is a formidable looking foe indeed, but one that must be vanquished nonetheless. This ends right now.
gets that little lot sent packing. Let's keep moving. Ha-ha! <laughs> All in a day's work. 